and welcome to Kentucky Brew Reviews. I'm Special K. I'm Fuzzy. And I'm Radar. Today we got Goose Fest beer. It is 5.7% alcohol by volume. And as you can probably figure out by looking at the label, it is uh, uh, Goose Island. And it's an Oktoberfest. It is. Or a Oktoberfest. And you can tell that because it says beer. It's spelled beer. It's spelled beer. Uh, bear. I do like the fact that they have um, the uh, IBUs on here too. It's a 23 IBUs, which is oh, okay. pretty normal for oh, yeah. an Oktoberfest. I'll, Fest I'll take it. This pretty much looks like just about every other Oktoberfest we've gotten so far. It's got a light khaki yeah. head. Yeah, this one's super clear though. A lot of them been a little bit cloudy. Mm -hmm. A little bit, yeah. Um, this company's owned by Anheuser Busch, if I remember correctly. You are. Yeah. You do remember correctly. Yeah. In fact. So carbonation is medium to going on heavy. Yeah, but good head. It doesn't on, smell though. very strong. It smells kind of ready and kind of clean. It's mm -hmm. got a clean smell, like a super. Cold. I wouldn't call yeah. this a, like from the smell. I wouldn't call this an Oktoberfest. I wouldn't. Yeah, I wouldn't be able to call this. Because usually all. Uh, most Oktoberfests have a, a bit of a sweet smell to them. But. Getting a little metallic notes in the nose a little bit. Yeah, whatever. Yeah. Huh? Yeah, I can drink this. It's not too sweet. A lot of Oktoberfests come out that come out are just too sweet. Not getting any like. hops in there. Yeah, it's not really hoppy. There's just that. There's just a <laughs> little bitterness on the end, but yeah, this. Other than that, it's actually really drinkable. Oktoberfest light. <laughs> I um, go, wouldn't go that far because it still has that sweetness of an Oktoberfest. <laughs> um, just... yeah, it's 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 still a little sticky on the back end, mm -hmm. tiny bit caramely, um, very malty, a little bit bready. It's not. It's got a slight metallic note to it, just ever so slightly. Not not enough to throw you off or yeah, anything. Yeah, I, I I don't really pick that up, but yeah, you're probably right. I don't yeah. love it, but it's definitely not bad. It's mm. very drinkable. It has. Actually, the I don't more know, I drink has, it, has, I'm has, getting that metallic yeah. taste on the back end. Just touch, yeah. It's not bad. Yeah, I it's think, very drinkable. Yeah, I think I'm like a little sweeter, but that's just me. Stop just by like and say hello to their tap room in Chicago. Hi. Uh, I'm gonna give this. This is for me, honestly. I think it's. I'm gonna give it a six point five. Uh, it's above average. It's going towards a good range. It's not quite there. Yeah. Um, would I recommend it over other Oktoberfest? No, because I think there are quite a few better Oktoberfest in this. But is it bad? Absolutely not at all. Oh yeah. Uh, if you're if you're getting a sample of six pack, then maybe throw it in there. But I wouldn't recommend buying an entire six pack. Ever. Yeah. Because so I imagine what a six pack of this is probably what eight, eight or nine, nine bucks yeah, or nine nine something. Yeah. Would you? Uh, Ready, I think I'll echo your sentiment. Give it a six point five. It's one of those. It's good. It's drinkable. The metallic taste just becomes more prevalent the more you drink it. I think, and for me, that's kind of a turn off. I mean, some people might like that taste, but for me, yeah. What about you, Radar? I don't know anyone who's ever been like, yeah, metal. I love to eat it. Well, but, <laughs> but uh, if you worship, so. I, I kind of. <laughs> kind of see where you guys are coming from with the six and a half but I want to give it a six and it's because of the metallic taste mm -hmm. now it is really drinkable and it, it is also not bad yeah but uh, I, I don't <laughs> think uh, I don't know it is, there's not a whole lot going on with this and like I say it's kind of like Oktoberfest light it's yeah. kind of sweet but apart from that it doesn't have anything in it and you yeah. can't say this beer is old like beers get metallic when they sit heat for a long time or they get exposed to like typical metal like if they're sitting on a silent cap. Oh yeah. Um, this is an Oktoberfest, it's October, so this beer is not that old. Mm -hmm. It was brewed in the end of July. Yeah. So it's it's you know a few months old. Yeah. So it's not it's, I mean can be a long time in beer years. Well it's got best five hundred and eighty days, so we're okay. definitely we're definitely within yeah. that realm. Alright, well that's our episode. If there's something you'd like to see on the channel, you can leave a comment down below. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. I'm Special K. I'm Fuzzy and I'm Radar. Thanks, Thanks for, for watching. watching.